Sometimes in family constellation, people asking me how concretely uh, family constellation works. So I will explain to you. There is two types of people who can come to family constellation. There is the people who want to constell for themselves. So they have any subject they want to, uh, to work on with the family constellation. And there is people uh, who, want, who want to help others uh, to make their own family constellation. So if someone wants to make uh, his family constellation, mostly uh, he will explain why he wants to do a family constellation. And I will start uh, to ask some questions to know more about it. Then um, I will ask the person to choose uh, some representative for his uh, family constellation. So he can uh, choose, for example, someone who will represent uh, the mother, someone who will represent the father, the uncle, the grandmother, grandfather, uh, etc., etc. And then we will uh, just uh, have a look uh, what happened. What happened uh, in, uh, into the non-verbal talking. So in non-verbal talking, I mean, uh, our body is an is a emotional body. So we want people uh, to feel what happened in the family constellation. So they can feel uh, weak, they can feel uh, cold, they can feel uh, hot, uh, they can feel that they don't want to see or to look at this person, or maybe they have some other feelings. Then when we will start to interpret and to understand the feelings of the people into the family constellation, um, we will uh, understand what the people want to express. So this is the emotional part of the family constellation. Uh, we will ask people to express what they want to express to the order where there is maybe a conflict or something to say or any secret that, that uh, are hide in the family constellation. So when we go into that, we will uh, try to make a new uh, balance uh, in the family constellation. So we will try to harmonize uh, what is unbalanced in the relationship with the situation or the people. And then uh, we will go into uh, giving back what we think uh, to carry for the others, what we think to good to carry for the others. And when we give back to the people, uh, what we are carrying for them, we create a new balance system also in the family. And those people are happy uh, to get back what it belongs to them. And then we will create the harmonization in the family constellation. Then, if it's possible, uh, we try to uh, say the sorriness to those people. And when we do uh, saying sorry, to the people and when it's possible we never push on it then we also uh, start to uh, liberate uh, a lot of energy and we will feel more light and more uh, less heaviness in our life we also sometimes go to see the ancestors on the lineage of the father or lineage of the mother and this helps us to heal the whole lineage as far as we can we go into the programming so just for four or five minutes uh, how the family constellation works. This is a fast explanation, but we, you can have already an overview of how the family constellation works in the practical way.